this video on the uh, underside of the uh, TPI Paxton Supercharge uh, uh, big tube runner car here. This is, uh, you know, 88 35th anniversary, obviously. You can't tell underneath it, but that's what it is. Um, four plus three car. So it's got a three inch uh, exhaust system on there. Some big pro flow mufflers on it. And of course that's your Dana 44. That's a 308 gear car because it's a four plus three, not a 354 or 345 like a zero one. Four plus three's got a quicker first gear. So uh, 308 works great in these especially with a point uh, eight six overdrive on them. And so that's the, uh, that's I've had on that a car, the way it runs forever. But I actually uh, ceramic coated that. We didn't do the back part, but that's all polished up. It's hard to tell from here, but it looks real nice from behind. But this is over the top. So that's your factory uh, GM part, what they call the off-road pipe. Obviously this car's got no catalytic converters on it. That's a glass pack that's in the middle of three inch glass pack to kind of quieten it down. So it's basically a dual into single uh, back out to dual. And I like it this way because it balances the sound of the motor out, makes it sound really good. And on TPI cars, that uh, this will actually improve your torque too a little bit with a big setup like this versus trying to zing it to the moon. Uh, and if you go dual, full duals, or you know, take, separate those pipes there, you get the crack, the dual crackling sound of a two four cylinders of the, this way. It's just sound, this car sounds incredible. Uh, so anyway, that's your four plus three. And, you know, basically it's a stock transmission, but that overdrive has been done. I guess uh, if I remember right, it's basically the internals of a seven, uh, uh, second, third gear of a turbo 350 that's on there and so I have it set up to where I have a switch on it I can turn it off at any time and so basically the way you drive a four plus three to go fast is you go first second third fourth and then you turn the overdrive on as you're going back to third and then fourth so basically you got one two three four five six gears that way and of course you can still kick it down in second uh, overdrive too and have all sorts of different ratios it's like a two-speed rear end basically so uh, once you got one of those built up pretty good I've had good luck with them um, but uh, I'd, I'd say to have better luck with the overdrives than the actual transmission. Transmissions are clunky. Uh, nothing like a ZF6 speed, but they're, they're not bad, but uh, I'd rather have a ZF6 speed. So anyway, that's the, the bottom of the motor, pretty much a stock look, looking setup here. And you can see the manifolds up there that are all been done with the uh, ceramic coating and the, the uh, shields have been coated off the manifolds. We put them all back together. And that's kind of that. So that's the bottom of it. I want everybody to see that. And I put it all back together here. Usually you would have on a stock L98, you'd have the pre cap right here and then your big center cat right there. So that's, uh, you know, no catalytic conversion on this car. Obviously it's off-road only. You'll never see the street, right? That's good. Never ever. So uh, it's just a race car now. Anyway, thanks for watching.